Before we had the Red Zone Compliance Module, we were continuously putting product on hold. We had focused on one specific product and our estimated savings is about $350,000 on that one product alone. You would find if you looked at our financials, where we were a year ago and where we are today, much better platform we're standing on. We're able to do profit sharing with employees. It's just changing the culture. It's changed my life, really. Clients uplift was 19%. This story had it all, personal transformations with the likes of Ryan Such, who was an operator that described himself as feeling unfulfilled, couldn't see a path forward, to someone who has recently been promoted, is now leading the charge on all things Red Zone, starting with the compliance module and more recently the maintenance module. A true team transformation with a QA team moving from a department that was primarily focused on policing and reacting to problems, to one that is now just as instrumental in productivity and financial improvements as they are in ensuring the production of safe, quality food. Led by Carrie Pearson and Shari Hernandez, this team has achieved some phenomenal results. A reduction of products on hold and rework to the tune of 80%. A savings of over $350,000 product giveaway on a single SKU through the use of SPC. And an additional 19% productivity uplift from the deployment of the compliance module. It's these types of uplifts that have enabled the introduction of a profit share and bonus scheme for all employees. I've never heard a production or maintenance team talk about their QA department with such pride. And I think Nate summed it up best when he said the Ogden team as a whole is now more unified, focused and collaborative and focused on the same goals than ever before. A true one team culture. Congratulations, Honeyville.